Mawagi. Showtime. Five more minutes, Mommy. I'm dreaming about eating the world's largest pizza. Go through this every week before every show. Watch this. Wagi, I just ordered a pizza. It's right over here. Where's the pizza? Hey guys, I'm Dylan. And I'm Wagi. And this is the Dylan and Wagi Show. Uh, we do this show every week. If you want to like and subscribe. If you like weird puppets who love pizza and the guys who always have to pay for their pizza and go broke doing it. Yeah, but you love my company, don't you? Do I, though? He does. <laughs> Sometimes I do. Anyway, guys, welcome to the Dylan and Wagi Show today. Uh, what are we talking about today, Wagi? Do we have a plan? Yeah, we're going to order some pizza and then shut off the camera. That was not the plan. No. Okay, you do want to talk about something. Right, we were just watching that movie, Wonder Woman, 1984. We had rented it with that box, remember? Oh yeah, guys, there's like a box in the middle of nowhere, and you push buttons and movies come out. Well, you have to put money into it, too. I didn't put any money into it, I just kept pressing on the buttons and all these things started popping out. I expected, like, Pop-Tarts, too. Yeah, Pop-Tarts didn't come out, did they? No, they did not, but we got some movies. Yeah, and also, I paid for it behind you, so that's why it wasn't magic. Well, it's magic to me. <laughs> Everything's magic to you in that little uh, pea brain of yours. Hey! I meant as a compliment. Are you sure? I don't know. Anyway, yeah, we rented uh, Wonder Woman 1984, this part two. Um, I didn't think it was a great movie at all. Uh, I liked the first one. This one was kind of a letdown. What'd you think, Waggy? You know what? I didn't like it as much as the first one either. Wait, was there a first one? Uh, yeah, it came out a couple years ago, maybe two, three years ago. Yeah, I don't remember that. <laughs> I didn't expect so. But guys, Wonder Woman is really cool. She's like super tall, it seems like, and she has powers, and can she whip people with a rope or something that's like electric? It's a lasso, and she doesn't necessarily whip people. She kind of wraps them around and swings and stuff, and it makes uh, people tell the truth when she wraps them around it. Really? Yeah, you don't remember that part? I was asleep after I ate the nachos. <laughs> it's true, he loves uh, snacks and movies, but uh, yeah, it wasn't quite as good, but... Uh, Oh, but you know what? Since she's so giant, I have a question for her. If you're listening, Wonder Woman, would you like to split a giant pizza with me? I know this place that has it that's like 24 inches. Pretty big. Yeah, I don't think she watches our show. She could be a big fan, secretly. <laughs> I don't think so. You know, we actually got a couple of dislikes on our last show, buddy. Really? Who the heck doesn't like me that they would hit the dislike button two times? I don't know, but you know what happens. That's YouTube. You know, you put out videos, you try to make an entertaining show, but there's always going to be someone who doesn't like it. And that's okay. That's, you know, opinions are different. And, you know, just do what we can do and try to have a good time. I don't care what anyone says. I love this show. Because I'm the star. <laughs> <laughs> Makes total sense. Um, guys, before we get to our next segment, uh, we're going to run a clip now. Do you guys want to see uh, Frizio the Monster and Wagi together? Stay tuned, guys. You're going to love this, okay? Hang on. We'll be right back. Oh, hi guys. It's me, Frizio the Monster again. And here's my friend Wagi from Walk It In My Pocket. Hello, everyone. Oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. I'm so excited, guys, because I woke up this morning and it was Easter morning. Oh, man, yeah, Easter Bunny came. Oh, yeah. Wagi, what did you get for Easter this morning? Did he leave you something nice? Oh, there was this giant, giant bunny, like super big, and I ate him. And it was so delicious. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. That was so good. I got some chocolate too. Chocolate? Yeah. Um, he wasn't chocolate. What? Yeah, he was a huge bunny. He was very furry. I ate a lot of fur in my mouth. Did you eat the real Easter bunny? I think so. Wasn't I supposed to? Oh, brother. No. How is he going to deliver Easter baskets to everyone else if you ate him? Well, he shouldn't have been wrapped up so nicely. I thought he was a present. What was he wearing? A vest and a bow tie and a... Uh... Oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. Wagi ate the Easter bunny. Ah, I hope he's he's not really gone for good. Is he, is he gone for good? No, I didn't eat all of him. Some of him hopped away still. <laughs> oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. Did you guys have a nice Easter? Did you get anything good before Wagi ate the Easter bunny here, brother? Ah, I got some chocolates and some eggs. 
and my parents hid Easter eggs and I found them. Did you do that, Waggy? No, I didn't have time. I was eating that big bunny. I'm still digesting him. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Happy Easter, guys. We'll see you later. Bye. <laughs> that was a hilarious clip. Um, Frizio and the monster uh, in Waggy. That's Puppet Playground. If anyone wants to link to that uh, who's not subscribed, let me know in the comments and I will... Um, I'll send you the link to it. You can check out the whole channel. It's got a bunch of different stuff on it. Oh, yeah, there's a lot of weird characters on there. There's even a snail guy in there. And I'm thinking about eating him because I like escargot. Don't you dare mess with Melvin. Is that his name? Yes, it is. He looks delicious. Waggy. I wonder if I could have snails on my pizza. Is that a topping? <laughs> this guy, I always try to eat my friends. That's a living. <laughs> no, it's not. Anyway. Oh, Dylan, what time is it? What time is it? Question and answer time! Yeah! Alive? Yep, let's do this thing. <laughs> He's such a pro at that now, you know? It's like it's just second nature. Actually, I have diabetes and I forgot my insulin. <laughs> oh man, are you going to be alright? Let me give you a shot. No, don't shoot me! Ah! Just kidding, he didn't even do anything. <laughs> All part of the show, guys. Anyway, questions and answers. Uh, I'd like to see some newcomers if they, uh, there was some more views this uh, last week, even though two dislikes, but no big deal. Anyone who wants to leave a question or a comment for me or Waggy or both of us, uh, leave your name, where you're from, that you can skip that part. Uh, just, just leave a question for us. We'll answer it on the next episode. Yeah, it doesn't even matter if you don't like us. Just be family friendly and nice. If you don't like us, don't say anything, okay? Don't be mean. <laughs> yeah, we're a positive show. We don't like negativity. Anyway, uh, my first question is Candace Cherry. Hello, Candace. So glad to hear from you. Candace, love you. Mwah. What did she ask, Dylan? She said, do all Waggies look alike? Well, Candace, when they're first born, yes. But they change depending on whether um, the owner throws them in the washing machine over and over again and then in the dryer and... Uh, <clears throat> are, you, are you looking at me? Yeah, I hate when you do that. Look at my hair now. What happened to it? it used to be beautiful. Like my brother's. <laughs> Sorry, buddy, but you got to be cleaned and I can't do it by hand. Why not? It says to it in my label. <laughs> <laughs> it probably does somewhere. It's all faded now, so uh, maybe. But anyway, the more I put you in the washing machine, the more distinguished you become. You're becoming a fine, handsome young gentleman. What? I don't even age. What are you talking about? I'm like a vampire. <laughs> Vampire who eats pizza, yes. But. Okay, just kidding. Anyway, yes, Candace, they all do come the same when they're born. And uh, they said, depends on how you care for them and wash them. But you beat this guy around in a wash too. <laughs> a while like that, you know, they get a little beat up. But he's still a nice, handsome wag, don't you think? Yeah, Candace, I know you like me. Mwah. Oh, that was my foot. Mwah. <laughs> so thanks for that question, Candace. Thank you, Candace. Bye. All right, next question is James from Arkansas. Hey, James, what's going on, buddy? I haven't heard from you in a while. I heard you're busy in Arkansas building uh, Noah's Ark. Is that, is that true? Really? You went there? <laughs> I don't know what I'm saying. I just make this stuff up on the fly, so. Noah's Ark, huh? Really? Seriously? James, don't listen to him. I don't even think you have a boat, do you? Is there even water in Arkansas? Is there like a lake or an ocean or something? I have no idea where that place is. Uh, anyway, what's this question, Dylan? <laughs> Um, Hi, James, by the way. Uh, he said, hey, Waggy, what is your favorite type of ice cream? Oh, good question, James. Cold. Cold ice cream. That's my favorite ice cream. Really? That's where you went with that? Uh, actually, James, I really like all the flavors, but seriously, I love uh, cookie dough. Very good. And coffee flavor. But coffee makes me super hyper, and then it bounces off the walls like... <laughs> yeah, so... I'm not allowed to have coffee anymore. The ice cream. I can still drink the regular cup, right, Dylan? Uh, no, that would be even worse than the coffee ice cream, I think. No! Oh, what if it's cold out? We live in Florida. It'll never be cold again here. Sorry, we're going to suffer and sweat all summer. Extra dope. Oh! <laughs> Very true. Uh, I got to agree with Waggy on that. like uh, the cookie dough and um, coffee is very good, too. There's this place, Friendly's, I used to go to, too. I still go there sometimes, but I used to go when I was younger and get... Uh, black raspberry flavor with chocolate sprinkles great combo for some reason i don't know that the sprinkles really did it for me on that ice cream but haven't had it in a while 
but lots of good ice cream out there and hopefully we'll do some ice cream reviews this summer coming up because it'll be really hot um, also hard to do though by myself when i do the food reviews uh, because it is so hot and limited capacity and seating and everything now it's like if i grab ice cream it's like 95 degrees out in florida it's very hot so that i have to do it really fast otherwise it melts so not easy but i'll try to do it if he doesn't do it if you don't see us eating ice cream this summer on camera like on this show or in his reviews it probably means he is eating ice cream but like really fast in the store and not even filming it or sharing with me <laughs> i wouldn't leave a wog in a car never leave your woggy or your child alone in a hot car please yeah especially not your woggy <laughs> thanks for that question james we have one more question this week I'm filming this uh, a day earlier than I normally do. My schedule's going to be a little in the, off, uh, up in the air, you know, so here and there. Um, so we're missing somebody who normally comments. Hopefully we'll catch them on the next time if we do, if they leave something. So this is from Tony. Oh, hi, Tony. I remember you from the time you didn't invite me to the movies. You and Dylan went and left me in the car. But I got in anyway, remember? <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, that was a long story. That was last episode. Dear Wagi, what is your most favorite Saturday morning cereal? And um, have you found any cool toys in the cereal bowls? Uh, yeah, cereal boxes lately, sorry. Well, Tony, I like Frosted Wagios, but they don't make them on this planet, so I guess I really like Cinnamon Toast Crunch. It's pretty delicious. But I'll eat anything, even your leg, Tony. Oh my god, seriously? Well, if I'm hungry enough. <laughs> okay, watch your leg, Tony. Everyone out there, watch your legs if you're around Wagyu. He gets very hungry. Yeah, if there's no pizza or anything else, I'm going for your big toe, too. Oh, boy. <laughs> anyway, so, uh, oh, what was the second part, Wagyu? Oh, yeah, and I got some Pokemon toys in my recent one. Uh, not toys, but uh, the cards. And I ate them, and they were delicious. Those are a collectible item. You're supposed to open it up and uh, play with it, or play the game, or at least, you know, not open it and collect it. No, like I said, I ate it. I thought it was part of the cereal. How did I know? I gotta supervise him more. That's ridiculous. Uh, so I hope that answers your question, Tony. Yeah, thanks for the question, Tony. Pokemon cards are delicious, by the way. Mm -hmm. Giving Tony a kiss? I don't know what I was doing. I was like, bon appetit. Mm -hmm. You know, don't Italians do that? I have no idea. I'm Amish. Really? Nah. I have some Italian in me somewhere. I just ate some spaghetti. But up, bum bum. <laughs> Wait, you had spaghetti without me? <laughs> No and no. Just kidding, Waggy. Don't toy with me about food, buddy. <laughs> all right. So that was all the questions we had today, guys. Before you tune out, uh, I got one more thing to show you. One more clip, surprise clip. So Stay tuned, guys. We'll be right back on the Dylan and Waggy Show. <sighs> oh, hi, guys. It's me, Melvin the Snail. I'm on my way to lunch. I left three days ago, so I'm so hungry. I'm almost there. Uh, uh, what's your favorite food out there what do you guys like to eat i enjoy bark and uh fruit and stuff like that and um i hope your favorite food isn't snails escargot because um i don't want to be eaten uh, uh, so hungry mm. i'll get there eventually guys enjoy your lunch enjoy your weekend and i'll see you later uh, Alright guys, we're back. We hope you enjoyed Melvin the Snail. Like I said, snails on my pizza. Oh yeah, I'm coming for you, Melvin. Please don't eat my friends anymore. No. Anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed the show today. We'll be back next week. Uh, thank you for joining us on the Dylan and Waggy show. Thank you so much everyone for your questions. Any newcomers, please leave us a comment. We love you too. Bye guys.